In this tutorial, we will take a look at how to authenticate to Simplify using Okta. First, we need to create an Okta application. To do so, log into Okta, go to the admin zone, and click on application. Click on add application. Create new app. Choose SAML 2.0 and create. Choose the app name you want. I'll choose to get Simplify, then click on Next. In the single sign-on URL, enter your Simplify server name, copy and paste. Then add this ending, SAML to slash ACS. Make sure the S and A are in capital letters. Then to the audience URI field, Copy the single sign-on URL and exclude the ACS. Scroll down and click on Next. Choose, I'm a software vendor. I'd like to integrate my app with Okta. Click on Finish. Congratulations, the app is ready to use. Now, go to the Assignment tab. Click on Assign. Assign to people. Choose the user. I only have Shachar here. Click on Assign. Now, choose the username for this user. It has to be the same as the user in Simplify. Click on Save and go back. Done. We are all done with Okta app. Now, let's configure the authentication through Simplify. Go to Settings, Advanced, External Authentication. Choose Okta. As you can see, the provider name is automatically populated. For the IDP metadata field, we need to create an XML file. Go back to Okta. Sign on tab. Click on View Setup Instructions. Optional. Copy all the data and create an XML file. Go back to Simplify and upload the file. In the Identifier field, you should add the Identity Provider issuer from Okta. It's on the same page as the IDP metadata. View setup instructions. Copy the identity provider issuer. In the audience URI field, navigate to Okta. General tab, audience restriction. Copy and paste. In the provider public certificate field, navigate back to Okta. Download the certificate and upload the file. Click on Save and then on Test. Great! Now let's create a user. Go to Settings, User Management, and create an Okta user. Make sure that the username is the same as you specified in Okta when you assign the user. Click on Add. Log out from the system and then sign in with Okta. Congratulations, you're all set with your Okta authentication.